Hey everybody, Mike Hagan here. I'm here to talk about getting low with your camera gear. This is one video in a series of six videos where I'm talking about gear design for low angle photography, macro photography, or even wildlife photography. What I have to talk to you today about is this little tripod here. It's a mini tripod. It's called the Kirk Mighty Low Boy. The Kirk Mighty Low Boy. Basically what this is, is a re-engineered Manfrotto 190XDB tripod. They took the Manfrotto tripod, they re-engineered it, they cut out some of the length so that it works well for low angle photography. The legs on this, of course, will splay out flat. In fact, there's three positions for the legs. There's the, you know, the, the uh, position for stowing the tripod, then there's the 30 degree, the 45 degree, the 70 degree, and then the 90 degree positions. When you're doing low angle work, you'll splay out the tripod legs flat like that, lay it on the ground, and then of course you'll mount your camera right there on your ball head. One thing to note is that the tripod when you buy it from Kirk does not come with a ball head, so you'll need to supply your own ball head or buy another ball head from Kirk like the BH1, the BH3, or like here I have a Markins ball head. So you can see at the lowest level here, the camera's about seven inches off the ground, seven or eight inches, that's fairly low. The height is really dictated by the height of the ball head. All right, so some other neat things about this little tripod. Because the fact that it's a modified Manfrotto, it has legs that will extend. So you can extend the tripod out like this and have it a little bit higher. So this works, for, it works pretty well for, for video work. If you have a video head or a video um, uh, uh, pan head, it works really great for that. Also, one thing to point out is that the tripod ships with an extension. So you can swap out the, the no length extension with the, this extension and the tripod then will extend up to about, I think it's 30 inches or 32 inches, something like that. But because the topic of this conversation is low angle photography, almost all the time you're gonna be nice and low everything compacted like this. So let's talk about some of the pros and cons with this tripod. Well, the pros, very small. It's extremely durable. It'll hold a lot of weight, you know, 15 pounds, 20 pounds of camera gear, no problem. In fact, it behaves almost like a hi-hat for video work. So I like that. The thing I don't like about it, in fact, probably the only thing that I don't like about it is the cost. It's pretty expensive. It's about $275. So. I don't know if it's any better than other tripods for that amount of money, but the fact that it's made by Kirk and it's backed up by their great warranty is a good thing. So it's a good product, slightly expensive. Anyways, that's all I have for this unit. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.